Hey folks, today we will be installing the Nest thermostat. So let's get started. All right, so I was on the app and I labeled which wires go to which points. And there's a little letter, it's hard to see, but there's a letter for each wire. Plugged it into the Nest app and now it's telling me to label those wires with these provided stickers, which is kind of cool. So I'm gonna now label each wire with a sticker and then I think it will eventually tell me which wire then goes to which part on the new Nest thermostat, which looks like this. So I have a yellow, so it's probably gonna go to Y1, a ground G, I have an RC, an RH, and so it looks pretty simple so far. So I just finished labeling the wires, pretty self-explanatory, but I labeled them anyway. RH for red, W for white, Y1 for yellow, and G for green or ground. So I didn't really need to label them because it's pretty obvious, but label them anyway. Next part is to install the backing piece of the nest, but it does come with this optional cover plate, which I'll probably use to cover up kind of this mess that the old thermostat left. Although it's just a little too small to cover everything. So I'm gonna have to kind of position this in the best way possible to kind of cover up the most amount of stuff. Like maybe this is up here now, but then if I move it up to cover that, then this is showing. So we gotta figure out like which section is least ugly. <laughs> but besides that, I'm gonna have to put in some drywall anchors to screw through here to mount it because this is just drywall, there's no stud here. But so far so good, not too bad. All right, so I got my drywall anchors. I'm, these ones you technically don't need to drill. Like they have a Phillips head here and they have, you know, they can screw through the wall, but I prefer to use a drill bit to clear out the majority of the space because otherwise it creates like a lot of dust and it honestly struggles sometimes to get through the wall. So we'll do that really quickly. I marked out the holes. Kind of see there's one right there and one right there. Okay, so now that those are drilled, we can screw these in. So now with this pre-drilled, pre you can kind of fit the majority of it in there and it goes in a lot smoother. That, so there's barely any dust that comes out and it fits nicely, it doesn't tear up the wall. It also goes in very straight. If you try and do it just by pushing it really hard into the wall and making it drill its own hole, it usually goes off center and cockeyed. And so I'm just gonna use, it came with screws, the nest, but I'm gonna just use the screws that came with these specific drywall anchors since it doesn't really matter as long as the head is big enough to not go through the hole, it'll hold it tight. So now we got this, this is just a separate piece and then it has these little holes on the back that line up with these holes. So just make sure those are aligned, that way it's you know perfectly centered. Line up your screw. I'm not gonna get it super tight just yet, just wanna get both screws in. And then now I'll align it how I want it specifically. All right, there we go. Now we just line up the wires to their corresponding markings. So first we got ground and I'll stuff in the excess. We push down here and then slide the wire in. Push the excess inside. And look how, see how there's a lot of copper still showing? I'm gonna trim these so there's not as much, so there's less chance of a short occurring. Ground is in. Now you can do white. See how none of the coppers are potentially gonna touch. That's how we cut those, cut those a little short. I think that 
plugs in. Next thing is switch the power back on. Sweet, it's on. So I'll just walk through the setup and it should get hooked up shortly here. All right, so that wraps up the Nest Thermostat install, relatively easy to do. If you have any other questions, please put them in the comments below. And if you'd like to see other DIY projects, we've done accent walls and bedrooms, media centers, new flooring. So subscribe and check out those videos. See ya, bye.